Tunaarifu kwamba maofisa wa mamlaka za kusawazisha bei za mafuta nchini wamekuwa na kibarua kigumu kueleza sababu za kuongeza bei za mafuta kwa zaidi ya shilingi saba. Maofisa hao walikuwa wakihojiwa na kamati ya fedha bungeni. Tusikilize ni yapi yaliojiri. Relating to development of the oil industry including to stabilize local petroleum pump prices in instances of spikes occasioned by high landing costs so how much have we collected and how much have we spent suppose you were uh, to revive our uh, refinery and import crude from which we can now uh, produce these other products could that be cheaper there was a regulation that had the consumers pay on average 1.98 shillings per liter which was uh, what we were calling the refinery support margin to support the inefficiencies of KPRL at the time uh, the landed cost of a liter in Mombasa was still cheaper than what was coming out of the refinery gate at KPRL and I believe that is why the government made a decision uh, to shut it down because it was bleeding the economy. Uh, the question as to whether we were able to revive the refinery, that is a conversation that is currently ongoing, I believe between the policy maker, the Kenya Petroleum Refineries Limited, and as well as the Kenya Pipeline Company on conversations on uh, what best to do with the refinery and I think maybe the, 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 the minister and the, the PS would be able to give or shed more light on that particular matter. On the issue of uh, the increases happening monthly, we do have an obligation to publish the maximum, as I, I repeat again, the maximum pump prices, both wholesale and retail, on the 14th of every month.